Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel. I have today one of my fall a Fab Fit Fun boxes. This is actually my second box and it came first. By second box, I just mean it's the additional annual subscription that I added a couple of months ago. I put it in a slightly different name so I would know the difference. Let's get in and see what I chose in this one. Fab Fit Fun. Fab Fit Fun is a lifestyle box. It comes out spring, summer, fall, and winter. It is $49.95 if you pay seasonally. It is $44.95 if you pay annually and you pay a year in advance. Whether you are an annual or a seasonal, you will have some customization. If you are an annual, you will customize the entire box. If you are a seasonal, you will customize four categories. And I can't wait to see what I chose in this one. Like I said, I added a second annual box, I think two seasons ago, and I make lists, you know, as I go through spoilers, just like you guys, you guys are always like, I watch the spoilers and I decide. I do the same thing as I'm going down. I'm like, okay, in first box, I want this. And in second box, I want this. I try and do most of my additional selections in the first box, but I think I did do a couple with this one. It has started coming in that bigger brown box. So when you open that up, or at least when I opened it up, I had this and then four of my items were outside this box. I'm surprised that they didn't fit. I didn't think I got anything big in here. I don't remember what I got in this one now. When we open it up, that is what it looks like. Oh, it has the cardboard that goes this way too. That's probably good. It probably gives it more stability. Let's see if I can get me and this in here. And that is what it looks like. When I take the paperwork out, that's the inside of my box. So yeah, I don't know that they could have gotten everything in here. Let's dig right into the paperwork. First, we have a $60 credit from Bright Sellers. There's the QR code if you wanna try and scan that. Next, we have a 14 free meals from HelloFresh, and there is, I hope that comes across. If you have any interest in that, of course this is all first come first serve. And if you have any interest in this, I will put my link below. It will get you $10 off your first box. I believe you can still order the fall box, but when you go in to purchase it, be sure that it says that the fall box is your first box. But for the first person who signs up, that is a code that will actually get you $15 off your first box. And then like I said, after that, I will have a link below that will get you $10 off. Here is our paperwork. It says Fat Fit Fun Feast on Fall Flavors. And I have these two. I think this one, spoiler, this one is in this box. That is what the paperwork looks like. And I know from watching Jess's live the other day when she did this, they did not tell us everything about all of the categories. It says, hey, does this page look different? Scan the QR code below to learn more about the products in your fall box or head to the FabFitFun Fall 2021 for the entire customization breakdown. I mean, I can do that. I didn't do that. I will run downstairs and get my notes from the spoilers and it'll do the same thing. But if they were gonna use those two pieces of paper anyway, why, why not make the information handy? Just saying. And then, oh my goodness, this talks about all of the flash sales that are coming up in September and October and all of these colors are flash sales. You guys that go back like I do, do you remember when they just had the edit sale between boxes? This time they have five themed sales and the edit sale. They're gonna do a fashion sale, a going green sale, a wellness sale, a Katie's Picks sale, and a bundles on bundles sale. I tell you, I try and stay out of them because Every time I go in them, I find something I want. Jessica and I even promised ourselves we were just gonna do the mystery bundle battles from the regular box and the edit sale because they throw those bundles in every single sale. Okay, I had to go find this paperwork. This is all of the paperwork that we did from those spoilers. So I can tell you what was in each customization and how much it was. In the first customization, I chose the Phantom Chef. I showed you guys when I did the spoilers, I have a Phantom Chef that I actually picked up out of a calls box, all true, market sale, because it was the exact size pan that I needed, but it ended up being this brand and I love it. So when I saw that this brand was doing a little fry pan, oh, this is a cute size. I thought it would be perfect. It is navy, my kitchen is not navy, but I don't keep my pans setting out anyway. So when I wanna reach for this, I thought it would be perfect for like fried eggs, just a little uh, one grilled cheese sandwich when my husband wants lunch and I don't, that kind of thing. It is very much, it looks very much, if not exactly like my pan. It's got the silicone feel, faux wood look handle. 
This is nonstick. I haven't tried nonstick because the one that I have is a pot, but I have cooked like risotto in it and it didn't stick to the bottom. So it's gotta be pretty nonstick. Very happy to add this to my collection. And that had a $40 value. You could also have chosen the Amica The Cure Bond Repair Shampoo and Conditioner, the Our House Waffle Knit Throw Blanket, the Golden Rabbit Dutch Oven, spoiler alert, that might be in my other box, the Black Battery Powered Toothbrush, the Uncommon James Set of Two Copper Canisters again, or the Pottery Barn Mason Diffuser again. And I picked the pan and I'm happy about it. And I was just putting this all away, by the way, and it says it's PFOA free and PTFE free. It is nonstick, dishwasher suitable, and ergonomic stay cool handle. Customization too. I actually did an additional selection in this one. I chose the Coach Open Circle Necklace, what they call them? Open Circle Necklace and T-Rose Stud Set. It had a $125 value. Comes in a cute little coach bag. This would be so, so cute to present as a present. I'm gonna take it out. It is nicely bundled. That is so pretty and sweet. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Isn't that just so sweet? It is rose gold. And in the middle of them, it looks like it has little stones in the earring. And then of course the stone in the necklace. That is so cute. And I love that it's rose gold. I am not sure if I'm going to keep this for myself or pass it along as a present, but that was a super, super fun choice. I like it a lot. And the additional selection I did, I did one of these in this box and one in my other box. You guys know, you've seen my Bath and Body Works hauls. I love a candle. And they had two of these Our House candles and I like Our House, so I had to have them. So this one is the Evergreen. So I must have gotten the Moroccan Spice in my other bags. I figured it would be perfect because I would have one for now for fall and then one for Christmas. And I haven't even taken this out of its bag yet and the waft of Christmas tree that is hitting me is fantastic. This is what it looks like once I get it out and it's just a nice copper. It's just, it's kind of rustic looking. It's gonna look really pretty back here. And the scent, it's total Christmas tree. I mean, it's like, it's total, total evergreen. It smells so good. It's like a cross between a flat out balsam Christmas tree scent but there's something just a little bit, just a little bit sweet about it. If you got this, let me know what you think. I think it's fantastic. Oh, it makes me think of Christmas and I just can't wait. So those are the two items I chose in customization too for this box. You could also have chosen the Uncommon Jane's Cheese Board. Hmm. The Cloud Nola Block Clock or the Rodeol Pink Diamond Lifting Serum. Customization three, I have two items in two. The first is the Stojo Collapsible Cup with four reusable straws. And look at the little box it came in. That just tells you how fun and collapsible it's gonna be. I chose this again because it was in, I think my cause box and it's so handy. And I thought it would be easy to have around the house for the kids. I'm a pro now. When I originally got this in the original box that I got it in, it was, it was, it was like I was building a bridge or a building. It was quite the, but now watch, I'm such a pro. You take out the bottom and then you can Let's take the top off, such a pro. You can pull the bottom just right open. I assumed my straws would be in here. They are not, they are in here. This is maybe a little bit bigger than the green one that I got. I don't know that this is as thick. I will let you know here once I go down and touch it. I don't think that this as, is as thick as my original one. And then you can just slide this on. You just slide on that little cuff and it protects you from the heat and it gives you something sturdy to hold. Then you just screw your lid back on and you are good to go. And it comes with four straws, which I thought was really cool because they're short. You know, they're not super long, so they're appropriately sized to the cups. And frankly, I thought as the grandchildren get older, I have two that are still fairly little, how fun would these be to have around the house to use as like advanced sippy cups? I just thought they'd be super handy. I like the idea of it for me too, but that's what my backup thought was. But then you can just, when you're done, you can take it apart, push the bottom back up just like I did and throw it in your purse. And I didn't do it, but just so you know, when you're done with your straw, it does fold and fit in here. Like if you get this dirty and you're like, okay, but what do I do with my straw? It will fit in here. I have done it with my other one and they show you how to do it. So that's kind of fun. And the other thing that I chose in this category is the APL backpack. And APL stood for Athletic Propulsion Labs. And this is the all-purpose packable backpack. 
This had a $60 value. The Stojo Cup had a $31.99 value. All right, that is the backpack, and it comes just like that. Just like a little zippy, it almost looks like a cosmetics case, but you can open it up. I am so hesitant to do this because we both know I'm never getting it in here nicely again. Oh, and it has a little clip you could clip it to, I don't know, your other backpack, and then you just pull it out. <laughs> Easy peasy. Here we go. I feel like everybody else that I have seen do this has done it so simply. Oh, I was holding too tightly to the bottom. You have to be willing to tuck it up in. It's kind of thin. I don't know that I would put super heavy things in it, but I like it. It is perfect for what I was talking about wanting it for. For like, you could put dirty clothes in it when you're at Disney World. You could take it flat and if you buy things, you could put it in it to bring it home. That's what you end up with, a full-size backpack. I love the leopard on it. It has the little mesh sides that you could put water bottles in. The top leopard portion zips and you could store things in there. It has two really nicely padded back kind of soft adjustable straps there is a big zipper in the back that is this full depth and then once you open it up on the inside you have this and it's a big area i was gonna see if it had any pockets oh it does if you get down in here it's got oh can i get that i don't know that i can get that if you get down in here it's got some little slide pockets like you know the ones in your purse that you keep your phone in they're little slide pockets like that so this is pretty cool. Um, I'm not gonna put this away right now. I'll put it away later. <laughs> so the other choices you could have made in customization three were the Camp Gladiator jump rope and three months of Camp Gladiator workouts, the Dose and Company Pure Collagen, the Amanda Uprichard belt bag, the Benefit Cosmetics Professional Pore Minimizing Primer, the Alterna Caviar Anti-Aging Replenishing Moisturizer CC Cream for your hair, the Pattern Beauty Curl Gel, the Vera Bradley Compact Organizer, and the, only if you're in the UK, Philip Kingsley Finishing Touch Polishing Serum. Customization four, I chose the Fry Boot Socks. They are a two pack with a $24 value. You could also have chosen the Crocus Pocus Buffalo Check Baseball Cap, the Mad Skin Care. They had three cleansers. They had a glycolic age diffusing, a delicate skin, and a salicylic skin care. And then they also had the Corez Renewing Body Cleanser, Santorini Grape, and the Elemis Papaya Enzyme Peel, which I already have. I chose the Fry Boot Socks. I'm hoping they feel really nice. Let's get them out here and check them out. Oh, they do feel soft. I was worried they would feel, I don't know, too polyester-y. They feel kind of polyester-y, but very soft. I will definitely be giving those a try. We had a charcoal, kind of heathered charcoal, and a black one. They do say fry at the bottom on the tip. Two pair of boot socks as we head into fall, which is fantastic because personally, my feet are always cold. It says it is a bamboo blend. Oh, well, that's why they feel so nice. 81% viscose, 18% Polyamide. So is viscose bamboo? I thought viscose was polyester. That's why I'm not in charge of the fabrics. Customization five. We have the Talking Tables Trivia Box, which I chose, the True Moringa Shea and Moringa Balm, the Pure Lease Pumpkin and Ginger Mud Mask, the Vesh Pedicure in a Box, might have done an add on, and the Gloss Modern Clean Luxury Hair Mask, which I own and love, by the way. I thought that this after dinner food and drink trivia would be so cute just to have around as we're going into fall and winter. If we have people over or if we go somewhere, we can take it. It is 120 questions on food and drink. Let's just open it and randomly select one. So go la 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 if you got this and you don't want to accidentally hear one that you might need to know at a party. Let's see. Which vegetable is sometimes called ladies fingers? vegetable called ladies fingers do you guys know i got it covered up with my thumb right away so i don't know ladies fingers vegetable asparagus oh 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 no i never would have guessed that no so you see the question and when you take it out you can just but the answer oh god so yeah i've never heard that i would never have guessed that and i don't love okra so all right, I'm gonna do one more. So again, la la la. The text says, when found on a beer bottle, what does the acronym IPA stand for? Embarrassingly, this one I know, <laughs> it's Indian Paleo. 
So we have 120 of those questions. It would just be fun banter. If not, you know, I like the cards that are meant to be conversation starters, and that could be a conversation starter. Like, who knows that? And maybe somebody knows because they live in New Orleans and then you get a great story, which by the way, if you are down there in the South, take care of yourselves. The add-on that I did in this category, because I wanted to have one for me and one for my mom, because when it came out last time, I tried to get it for us and she was interested and I couldn't. So this is the Petty in a Box Deluxe Four Step Pumpkin Spice, and it is two complete four step pedicures. And it's a sea salt soak, a sugar scrub, a mud mask, and massage better. Better? <laughs> massage butter. That is what it looks like. They are numbered. See how that says number one and this is the salt soak. I can't smell it, but it's pumpkin spice. I'm so excited. Okay, so anyway, I have that. All right, customization six. And this is where sometimes the train comes off the tracks. We used to always get eight items. We had the five customizations and then the three FabFitFun picks. In the beginning, they just picked them for us and we all got the same thing. And then they moved to, they picked them for us, but we got different things. And now they've moved to, if you are an annual, you can do your own picking. And in doing so, you can choose either a three item bundle, so you still end up with eight products in your FabFitFun box, or you can choose a two item bundle, so you're only gonna have seven items in your FabFitFun box, or you can choose one item, so you have six, items. I know the math became very simple on that. But if you only chose the one item, it was a much more expensive item. And then as you went down the line, the more items you added, the value in each one individual item was reduced. I hope that explains it well enough. I chose for this box a three item pack because I wanted two specifically of the items and I knew the other would be fantastic in a giveaway. Unfortunately, something must have gone amok because there were Kayo body scrubbers that were in a lot of these bundles. And they are kind of like the boyo, boyi ones that we see in our Instagram feeds a lot. And it's it's like a body scrubber. That got replaced with the Zoela Echo Friendly Comb Set. And you receive two combs. And one is a wide tooth comb, which is perfect for me for when my hair is wet. And the other is a fine tooth comb, which I actually also use because if I'm trying to pull my hair back, I need a fine tooth comb because I have such incredibly fine hair. And when we take them out, that is what they look like is the wide tooth comb. They feel kind of nice, kind of like maybe they're echo friendly or something. They feel a little bit like the bowls. If you got the bowls in the cause box, they feel a little bit like those. That is what that one it looks like. There's a substitution that we got instead of our body scrubber in this category. I also, in this one, got the two bandits and it's that little, I'm sure you've seen it, the little trays that, oh, I think a lot of people chose this one. I, in the beginning, when I was doing the spoilers, thought that it was ceramic. I mean, I knew way before I placed my order that it wasn't, but I thought it was gonna be ceramic. Oh, I'm surprised how heavy it is. That is a nice surprise. I was afraid that because it wasn't ceramic, it was gonna be very lightweight, but they've weighted, I'd say, the bottom one. So this is what it looks like. I thought about putting it back here and putting something in it. I don't know what I'm gonna do, but they just slide off to the side. Also, they slide more easily. I feel like I've seen people almost struggle with these. And I think, I mean, they slide very easily. So either I got lucky or I just read the room wrong. That is what it looks like. So you could store, if you're a crafter, you could put crafts in here, like beads or I, crafting stuff. That's just, you could put your little jewelry in there in the bottom of each one. And does it come out? They've put, yes. They've just put little, I guess maybe some kind of spun polyester that makes it, not be the plastic, but it gives it a nicer, you could set your stuff in. And then the third item in my selection was the Earth Harbor Marina. I have, I have these, I have, I have these. We have been getting a lot of Earth Harbor in our boxes and I get quite a few boxes. So I am not gonna, I mean, I'm gonna open it to show you guys like this, but I'm not gonna drip it for you. But that is what it looks like. Some people love all of the Earth Harbor. I like some of it. I have broken out a little bit when I've used some of the oils, not all of them, mostly the, it's the one that fades to red. I'll try and remember and let you know right here. So my customization six was these three products. And those three products had an $83 value. Now, part of that was the $15 Kayo body scrub, and I can't believe that these are $15 combs. And the Two Bandits tiered catch-all tray, this has a $30 value. When I thought it was ceramic, I was okay in believing that. I think it's 
plastic. I'm gonna go ahead and take exception, perhaps, at that pricing. Still like it. Still gonna try and use it. Don't think it's a $30 item. And then this was a $38 item. Okay, I'm not gonna go through the entire customization six because there were 12 choices and in each of those choices, some of them had three items, so we could do this for hours. But if you have any questions about customization six, my spoiler video can answer it all for you. I had an $83 value in that. After you do your customizations, now you are also offered refills and boosts. The difference is with refills, if you choose one of those items, you will continue to get it in your box every season without you doing a thing until you cancel that refill. You don't have to cancel your box, you just have to cancel that refill. I have done that. I got that Grown Alchemist cleanser that just didn't work for me. I went in at the beginning of the next season and canceled it easy peasy. I will refer you back to the video where I did all of the refills because they have added so many things to refills now. They're doing cleansers and serums and moisturizers and body creams. They're just doing so many items but if you like them they are at a greatly reduced price. I do have them here like oh one of the things that you could add this season is you could do puppy toys and each season you will get a different set of puppy toys for your puppy and I thought that was a really cute idea. The next thing you can do is the booster box and each season when the box comes out they add items that they greatly reduce the price of so it's you can just put it in your box or you cannot. It just comes at the end of your customization as one of your choices. The things they added this season were the Fry X FabFitFun collab box I don't think I ended up adding that to either of my boxes. It was like $50 I'm sure it's worth it if you love all of the items that were in it for me. It didn't quite seem worth it. You could add the Stone Cold Fox Thermos. It had a $68 value. Oh, I wrote all of this down before they let us know. I think it was maybe $18. It had the Kanika FBD Calming Eye Balm, Soya and Kayo Oakland Jacket. They had a PMD, you know, microdermabrasion. So they add lots of things and they take them and they greatly reduce the price. And it's just that one season. It's not like refills. You don't keep getting it. I added this season because I really like the way it looked. Not because I need it. The last thing I need is another thermos. I, I just don't. Oh, look at this and it is so much prettier in person oh my gosh look how pretty this is guys with the birds on it look at this guy here it is so it looks like an old if you're around old enough that maybe your Grammy had it too it looks kind of like blue willow do you remember the blue willow dishes this kind of looks like that it is stone cold fox it is 17 ounces hand wash only made in China they said it had a $68 value, please. But it was like $18 and for that, so you can close and open it. So I guess you can drink from it without having to take this off. That's pretty cool, but you can take it off. And then that is what the inside looks like. So I added this, I figured, you know what? It's pretty, I like it little cup. This is like old-fashioned thermos. Like, here I am going off to my construction job. All right, that completes my first FabFitFun fall box. Technically, it's my second because it's my the second box that I ordered, but it's the first one to arrive, so here we are. I don't have my add-ons because I do my add-ons with my first box, and that's also where I do my mystery bundle, although I will say my add-ons have shipped, and my mystery bundle has not. There are three items. Two of them go in my dojo cup that I added to my other box so that I would, you know, have enough for all the girls is part of the things that didn't ship. So it's weird things that haven't shipped. But anyway, I hope you are getting your FabFitFun boxes out there. I hope you are loving them. Oh, what is this? Something in an odd little bag. Let's see what this is. Okay, <laughs> this is odd. You now sometimes they send you, okay. Heineken, 0.0, 0.0 alcohol, 100% taste. Hashtag, now you can. I, I mean, okay, it's an adorable little box. With, <laughs> it's just a little, what, they, what was the, Odul's? Is that the one that has always been, I think Odul's is the fake beer. This is just a Heineken fake beer. It's so cute. It's it's adorable. I, it's an unusual choice. Thanks for coming by, guys. Let me know below what you're thinking of FabFitFun this season, and we'll talk really soon. Have a great day, guys. Bye!